Tom Moran. Did I say that right? Yep. Okay. Tom Moran. Tell me what you think of the quadricep. I like it. it. You know, right now I'm struggling with uh, back spasms. My hip flexors are really tight. This is helping me uh, go through full range of motion and loosen things up. It's really helping to pump my ankles and, uh, you know, basically improve my overall flexibility. Tell me your background. Okay. My background, I have an undergraduate in adapted or in general physical education uh, with a minor in exceptional psychology. I have a master's degree in adapted physical education and I'm currently pursuing my PhD at the University of Virginia in adapted physical education and do a lot of my work with individuals with cerebral palsy and uh, their fitness levels as well as a lot of my work with community-based activities and helping individuals with disabilities be physically active. When you did the study on using the quadricizer at UVA, tell me what some important things that you learned with quadricizer. Um, well, again, the, the subjects that I was using were uh, individuals with very severe spastic CP, individuals who are overweight, who have a tough time doing any sort of activity that uh, will raise their um, heart rate. You know, so we really struggle with can we find an activity to improve their cardiovascular endurance. And I was able to use the quadricizer to um, elevate their heart rate to a level where they're able to burn calories and, um, and get a good workout. And uh, we were also able to identify some significant differences in their, their overall strength and flexibility measures um, with the use of the quadricizer. What makes you qualified to work with somebody with CP? Well, being that I am an individual with cerebral palsy, uh, born with spastic diplegia, so you compound that with my understanding and, and expertise in adaptive physical education, I think I'm pretty qualified. <laughs> I think so too. <laughs>